Welcome to day one of swim week. If you're brand new here, every single year I like to do a thing called swim week where I try on swim wear from different brands every single day. So today is the first day and we're going to be trying on Amazon. I'm always excited about Amazon and I love Amazon. Here's why. The returns are super simple. <laughs> One of you told me to talk about what it's like to return from each of these brands as well. So I'm gonna start including that in my videos because I think that's also really helpful. You can't try on the clothing, so how are we gonna know what it looks like on us, right? Returns are important. Some companies make the return process a headache. Amazon does not, it's so simple. So if I don't want something from Amazon, all I have to do, at least how it is here, this is how it operates here, is I just take it to the UPS store. I don't need to box it. I don't need to print a shipping label. The shipping label's on my phone. They scan it. That's it. Amazon has really improved through the years. They have expanded their plus selection a little bit. There's still work to be done, just as there is anywhere else. I would say a lot of my favorite suits that I've ever tried on are from Amazon. So if you are excited for this try on and for this series, hit that thumbs up button so I know. And let's begin. So this first swimsuit is actually from Shein. I ordered the size two extra large and it does fit really well. Now Amazon says this item is no longer available, but I will try to scour the internet seeing if I can find it somewhere else because sometimes you'll be able to find the same swimsuit just with different search terms. So I will try my hardest to find this one for you all. I like the quality of this suit. It feels really soft and it's pretty comfortable. The bottoms are a little bit snug, but I really like the cut in these and the top does fit really well. The cups are padded on this one and I paid $22.99. This next suit is a one piece from Cupshe. Cupshe is very similar to Shein in case you don't know. And I tried hard to avoid those two for this try on because it's just supposed to be like Amazon, but there's a ton of like online Chinese sellers selling on Amazon. So you kind of always get a mishmash of things. I'm wearing the extra extra large in this one and I could definitely size up. It's most uncomfortable on my shoulders, but it's not painful. The cups are lined and there is a lot of support for the bust on this one. I love the mesh material, the lining on the bust, as well as the flutter sleeves. I'm five feet five inches, so the way that a one piece suit fits me is kind of based off of that. <laughs> and I do have my measurements down below as well, um, but that can give you kind of an idea, my height, because one piece is, you know, if it's not like a one piece specifically designed for long torsos and there's not many out there, it's gonna fit a taller body way differently than it fits mine. This suit was $32.99 and I do like the quality in this one. I think it's pretty, pretty good, pretty good quality. All right, this polka dot one piece is our next suit today. This is from the brand Coco Ship. So this one actually looks like a swim dress, but there are shorts underneath. I feel like every single year I try on a suit that's similar to this one. I just love it. I love the vintage feel. Uh, I think it's just like a really fun classic throwback that you just have to have in every try on. It's classy, it's timeless. I mean, who wouldn't love a suit like that? It is a halter top, which as you may know, aren't my favorite. But for a suit like this, I think it's pretty necessary to fit the whole aesthetic. I'm wearing the size three extra large and it fits perfectly. They have a ton of color options in this suit. There's a blue and white polka dot version of this suit that is absolutely adorable. This suit was $36.99, which I think is a steal. I feel like it's comparable to something that you would buy from Mod Cloth, but Mod Cloth is notorious for being, you know, overly, expensive <laughs> for what you get so i feel like this is a much better option there are cups in this suit as well next up we have this two-piece green set from a brand called unique or yonique this one fits so comfortably i did size up from my regular sizing in this one and size up to a 22 plus probably because i read all the reviews and it probably said to do so so usually if i size up it's because i scoured and made sure everything was uh all the reviews told me to either size up or size down or, or do my normal size the reviews are everything so when i do these amazon try-ons just know that all of these things have good reviews 
or else I wouldn't be trying them on. The top has adjustable straps and cups. The bottoms have the ruching as well as the crisscross mesh on the sides, which is a cute look. I believe everyone looks fantastic in this color, but if this color isn't your jam, they have a ton of color options. I paid $33.99 for this one, and so far I think it's my favorite. This next bikini is another one from Cupshe. I do feel like with Cupshe, things are either a hit or a miss. And most of the time with a body like mine, it's a miss. I'm wearing a 3X in this one and it fits pretty amazingly. I was bummed, however, that the bottom straps that go across like the waist don't lay down on my body like the picture shows. They kind of bunch up under the bust instead and it's really uncomfortable. I really love this top color though. I don't really have much in this color and I need to wear more of this color. You can also mix and match this top and bottom which is nice because it gives you more swim options. These bottoms are incredibly comfortable and stretchy and I paid $32.99 for this suit. Ooh, we got ourselves a bright and in-your-face suit. That's the way I like my suits. Sometimes. Not all the time. But if I want if I want something that's a little bit more showy, I'm going to go for something like this. This is a neon orange suit. It's from a brand called Sovo Yanti. I think it's how you say it. There are multiple colors to this suit if this bright neon color is not your jam. I bought this one in an extra extra large and when I just held the bottoms up and I was kind of looking at them, they didn't look like they would fit. However, they have a lot more stretch than I thought. They're also ruched. We love our ruched bottoms. The top fits a lot like a wireless bra and the straps are adjustable. Then of course we have this fabric over the cups to make it look like a flowy top. And this is a suit where if you want to hide a little bit more of your stomach or you're trying to branch out into wearing a bikini, this might be a good option for you. I feel like it's like the happy medium. And with the price point of $27.99, you can't really go wrong. Both pieces are so comfy. I thought this next piece was really unique and I wanted to find a triangle bikini for plus women because it's really, really hard to find triangle bikinis for plus women. I bought the extra, extra large and the bottoms are way too small on this one. They also show a lot of belly, which is typical and normal for a suit like this, but they were really digging into my stomach and it just wasn't uncomfortable. The top seems a little bit big and everything is out in the open with the suit as you can see. But let me show you why I bought it in the first place because this is what sold me on this suit, the cover up. It matches the top and the bottoms and it is a mesh material so you could literally just go into the pool wearing this and it would dry so quickly when you get out of the pool. So uh, that is what drew me to the suit because I had never seen something like this before and I really, really love the colors. I love the print and I think it's just like a fun idea, you know? I love it. I really, really love this set. When I wear this, I feel so sexy. I had to, I had to take my hair down and everything <laughs> just for this try on. <laughs> it also makes my booty look really luscious. So I don't have any complaints there. The brand on this one is Rom, Romwe and I paid $27.19 for this one. I would just change the bottoms and wear some like white high waisted bottoms with it. And there you go, cutest. This two-piece suit is pretty adorable. <laughs> I like it. It kind of has this vintage feel to it with the twist in the front. But the print is modern and tropical. And of course they have all the color variations in this suit, but I wanted to try a fun print. The top on this one have adjustable straps, which kind of give it the feel of like a push-up bra. There's no wire in the uh, bra, but the fabric under, you know, the bust really adds to that like vintage feel to the suit and gives more support. I bought this suit in the 20 plus, which fits perfectly. The bottoms on these are really ruched and stretchy. This is a very comfy and very supported swimsuit. The brand is Dassey and it was $33.99. This fishnet combo is a lot of fun. You can see it in both the top and the bottoms. Honestly though, I personally think this one looks better on the model on the website. And if I can just be real, I was kind of having a bad body image day on this day when I was filming this. I was realizing, you know, as somebody with uh, saggy boobs, like bathing suits are just gonna fit differently on me than they are gonna fit on the online models who have perfectly round boobs. And that is something that I've had to come to terms with. <laughs> and I am. 
every day I come to more terms with it. Well, you know, every now and then I like to smack you in the face and be like, your boobs are supposed to look like that. No, they're supposed to look like this, exactly how they are. So I ordered this one in the extra extra large plus and the top fits pretty well in size. The bottoms though are a little bit too snug for me. They still fit me, but I would want to size up to have a little bit more coverage. This brand is called Florence and it was $28.99. Again, there's many colors if this neon yellow is too much in your face. Next up, we have this bright pink tankini swim dress. Swim dresses are one of those styles that I like to show in my swim weeks. Even though I don't typically wear them myself, I like to give as many options as possible for everybody watching this. Because I understand that the people who watch my videos are all kinds of different ages, they have all kinds of different occasions, you know, they have different levels of security in what they're wearing on their body, um, or different levels of confidence, and all of those things are totally fine, and that's why I just want to make sure that I uh, continuously show things that I maybe I wouldn't normally wear myself, but to show you and give you an idea of what something else will look like on my body. Here's the thing with swim dresses. If you're a fan of normal dresses, then you'll love swim dresses. And that is why I like swim dresses, because I love dresses. <laughs> so if that's kind of your style, it's really easy to transition over to a swim dress. You know, you're not really showing that much extra skin than you would with a regular dress. This one comes in many colors. I bought the 20 plus and it fits really well. My favorite part about the swim dress are the straps. They're on the thicker side and they were laying very comfortable on my shoulders. No pulling, no tugging, and it wasn't uncomfortable. The top does have the cups and then the ruching and the twist in the front. And then it's like an A-line all the way down, just like most dresses. It comes with these swim shorts as well and they fit really great. And actually you could use these swim shorts for other bathing suits. So that's really nice. It's kind of like a two for one. <laughs> this swim dress had amazing reviews, which is one of the reasons why I was drawn to it. Swim dresses are one of those things that usually aren't very affordable. So this one's only $36.99. Totally, totally worth it. The brand is called Aqua Eve. This two piece is definitely my least favorite of everything I tried on today. I should have known that this top would lack support completely. But the colors of the top and the bottom look differently than they did on the website. I feel like they don't really match in color. And the color combinations just, it's, it's kind of throwing me off a little bit. <laughs> the only thing I really like about it are the ruffles on the swim top. This, this is another cup she option. And uh, to this day, I just, I really haven't had a ton of luck with cup she. Like I said, hit or miss. I bought this in a three extra large. And while the bottoms fit well, and they work. The top just uh, doesn't have a lot, <laughs> doesn't have a lot going on and it doesn't cover much. And it's, you know, I have to stop buying things where models with perfectly round boobs buy things. <laughs> it just doesn't always work. Sometimes it works, so, sometimes, sometimes it does. Which, by the way, we don't use the words flattering, okay? We say, it doesn't do my body justice. That's my new thing and I'm sticking to it. This top doesn't do my body justice. This suit is $36.99 and I think it should be way less than that. I think that's a little bit ridiculous. Okay, we're on the last suit of today's try on. This is a bikini halter swimsuit with a high-waisted bottom. Brand is Dassey. I am wearing the size 20 plus. There's a variety of colors in this one as well. And like I said earlier, I'm not the biggest fan of halter tops, but I like to show a variety in my videos. Both pieces fit pretty well. I mean, the bottoms are a little bit snug, but they work. They also have fabric to wrap around the back and tie on the sides. This is a suit I probably wouldn't wear because of the halter. But the one thing that I do like about halters is the fact that you have a little bit more control over uh, the suit and how much it covers. This suit was $32.99. That concludes today's try on. Thanks for watching. Let me know which one was your favorite because honestly, I get influenced by your thoughts as well. <laughs> I like to know what you guys like the most. Let me know down below in the comments. Also in the description box, I have links to every item on there. That's in every single video that I do every try on. You can always hit those links. I actually get a small percentage of whatever you buy as well. So it helps me out. Thank you. Thanks for using my links. Uh, thanks for watching today's video. Leave that sticker and emoji if you stayed all the way into the end. And make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss any more videos this week. 
I'm really excited to show you additional swim brands all week long. I'm excited that, you know, like we're just getting to like summer and swim season. It's exciting. So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I will see you tomorrow.